Hi, in this video we'll show you how to get started with creating your, your classes. Now, I've already created a class here called Tech Ed 101, and the section is Section A. Uh, but if you haven't created any classes as yet in your Google Classroom, you can go to the top right-hand corner, where beside that's just beside where you have your um, the name of your account, and uh, you can see that's a plus sign. And you can see that you have two options. One is to create or join a class. Well, one is to create a class and the other is to join a class, right? So once we click on that plus sign, you should now notice two options. Once again, you can join a class that already exists as a student or as a teacher, you can create a class, right? So we're gonna click on the option for create class. And once you do that, uh, you would see a little notification here uh, just asking to verify whether you're using this as a personal account or as a school account. In this case, I'm not, so I'm just going to go ahead and check this box here that I've read and understood the above notice, and I'm not using Google Classroom at a school with students. There we go. But if you are using Google Classroom uh, for student uh, purposes, at I mean, for school purposes, and um, you would need to set up then. It says here, if so, your school must sign up for a free G Suite um, for education account. This is very, very important. So I'm not just gonna skip through this very quickly, right? So if you are using this at, uh, at a school, the first thing you need to do is to set up this account. And I'll probably just show you that in another video. But you can click on this option and it will take you to the page, the sign up page and you can create that G Suite account uh, for your school. But in this case, I'm not. So I'm just gonna check this box here. And if you, you do that, of course, you'll be able to um, get access to more uh, services and products that Google offers. So that's very, very important once again. So for my case, I'm just gonna click on, I've read and understood, and I'm not using Google Classroom at a school with students, and click on continue. All right. So once you have done that, uh, the next thing you have is a class uh, name. So if you want to have the same class with multiple sections, I could just go ahead and give this the same name. So for example, I could say Tech Ed 101, all right? And I could say Section B because we already have Section A, okay? You can choose a subject if you so desire and um, also a room if you desire as well there we go so we can go ahead and click on create here and so it is actually going through that process of creating but once you have created your class you will now see that in the class list section and uh, you now have a code, for example, uh, we have a code here that we can use to allow students to join the class, right? So each class has this code that allow you to um, invite students or you can copy, send it to their email, etc. cetera, um, or you can just allow them to join uh, using the code. But once you have done that, if you want to see all your courses that you have actually created, you can go back to the main menu uh, option here and then you can see all your courses uh, that you have uh, created all right um, you can go back to home if you so desire and here you can also see another view of all the courses uh, that you have and uh, you can go ahead and select each course that you have individually all right so this is how you create a course in Google Classroom. I hope that this actually helped you to achieve your goal. And if it did, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment, and click on that notification icon for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.